It's not every day that researchers can claim that they've unearthed evidence of a completely new kind of human being. But that's exactly what archaeologists in Russia say that they've come across. But how could a tooth and a finger discovered from a species called the Denisovans, who were once widespread across Asia, revolutionize our understanding of early man? The BBC science correspondent Palab Ghosh tries to explain. Tens of thousands of years ago, our species lived alongside a different type of human, Neanderthal man. Now, scientists have discovered that we also shared the planet with another distinct human creature, the Denisovans. We know this from DNA analysis of this piece of bone and tooth. They were found in these caves in southern Siberia. It's a discovery that's astounded the experts. If the team publishing this have got it right, it's nothing short of sensational because what they've discovered is a completely new lineage of DNA that is not Neanderthal, that is not modern human, that was probably widespread in Asia and actually links in to one particular group of living humans. And all non-Africans have some Neanderthal DNA. It's these startling findings, published in the journal Nature, that are changing our view of human evolution. It's beginning to emerge that several types of humans coexisted, but why did these others die out? We simply don't know. But for a while, there were many others who walked the earth with us. Palab Ghosh, BBC News.